I'm back with another video and in today's video we have a Dell Inspiron 15 7000 series and in this video I'm gonna go over how you can replace the keyboard for your laptop if yours is really you've got a damage some keys are not working or you simply just want to replace it with a new one I'm gonna cover this in this video it's really easy it takes up to probably three to four minutes I'll leave the link for a compatible keyboard there's a keyboard with a backlit and the one without the backlit if you don't want a backlit, it's cheaper, but if you want it, it's a little extra money. All right, you don't need any screwdrivers or anything like that. All you need is an opening tool. For the opening tool, I'll be using a guitar pick, and metallic guitar picks are really suitable to opening to doing this service. You only need a curved tweezers also. With this to one hand, we want to get it started. First thing first, make sure you power off the laptop. You want to put the uh, opening tool right in here in the middle. You see, there's a, on top of each key, there's a little gap right there, hinge between the last two keys right there, between delete, F10, F5, and escape. So you want to stick the opening tool right in there, and you want to just push that clip towards the back towards the screen. So I'm going to stick it there. I'm going to just push it towards the screen. I'm going to lift it up a little bit. I'm going to do that for every tiny clip there. So stick it there and then it's kind of a little harder and uh, you just want to stick it right in there and then lift it up do that for the last one on the left side and there we have it once you have it, you want to grab it from the middle and you want to bring it up slowly and it's going to release this side. And you want to pull it towards the screen a little bit. And now we can flip it upside down towards the front end of the palm rest. And then we're going to see a flex cable for the LCD and flex cable for the keyboard. To open up this one, you don't want to yank it up. You want to put your fingernails at the back of the in this black jack right here and you want to lift it up 90 degree upward. And next, you want to grab the cable flex and bring it up in 45 degree angle. Don't yank it straight. Now, for this one, same thing. Lift up the black out with your nail and pull out the flex cable. And there's your cable. This is a Spanish layout cable keyboard. You can grab an English or whatever language that you want. You can change it without any problem. Okay, I'll leave the link for a few keyboard, English keyboard. Now, let's say that you got the new keyboard there. First thing first, let's go ahead and plug in the flex cable for the top backlit. It says side up, so that means this side is up, the contact has to be facing down. If you pay attention, the flex cable, they have a little tiny earlobes on the side, so you can't go straight inside the jack, you have to go in a 45 degree and land it on the inside the jack. So I'm going to open up the jack is open position, we're going to bring it down in 45 degree all the way inside the jack. And then hold it there and then close up the lid right on top. Same thing in here. There are tiny earlobes on the side. You want to bring this one down in 45 degree inside the jack all the way in. And you want to close it down. Once you did that, now all you need to do is to bring it in this position. Put this bottom front end of the uh, keyboard right under the palm rest. Hold it from the middle, push down the sides, make sure you tiny the clips. Now let go and push down on every clip and you should hear those click sounds. And that's it. And that's how you replace your keyboard for your Dell Inspiron 15 7000 series. I hope you guys liked this video and helped you guys out. If you have any questions or requests, feel free to leave them in a video comment or try to answer them as soon as I can. As always, thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in my next video.